Day of the Refugios. In Mexico and Latin America, it's common to celebrate one saint's day instead of one's birthday. This is an act of community. I was born in Nogales, Arizona, on the border between Mexico and the United States. The places in between places, they're like little countries themselves, with their own holidays taken a little from everywhere. My 4th of July is from childhood, childhood itself a kind of country too. It's a place that's far from me now, a place I'd like to visit again. The 4th of July takes me there. In that childhood place, that border place, the 4th of July, just like everything else, it means more than one thing. In the United States, the 4th of July, it was the United States. In Mexico, it was the Dia de los Refugios, the Saints' Day of people named Refugio. Now, I come from a family of people with names, real names, not afraid names, with colors like the fireworks, Refugio, Margarito, Matilde, Álvaro, Consuelo, Humberto, Olga, Selina, Gilberto. Names that take a moment to say. Names you have to practice. These were the names of saints. Serious ones. And so it was right to take a moment with them. I guess that's what my family thought. The connection to saints was strong. My grandmother's name... Here it comes. Her name was Refugio. And my great-grandmother's name, it was Refugio. And my mother-in-law's name now, it's another Refugio. Refugios everywhere. Refugios and shrimp cocktails and sodas. Fourth of July was a birthday party for all the women in my family, going way back. A party for everything Mexico where they came from, for the other words in the green-tinted glasses my great-grandmother wore. These women were me, what I was before me. So that birthday fireworks in the evening, all for them, this seemed right. In that way, the fireworks were for me, too. Still, we were in the United States now, and the 4th of July, well, it was the 4th of July. But just what that meant in this border place and time, it was a matter of opinion in my family.